Hello guys, this is Mad for Automation. Today I am going to demonstrate my door security system project. For this project, I am going to use the Bolt Wi-Fi module from Bolt IoT as a control board. The Bolt Wi-Fi module that I am using here is a great platform for IoT projects. It connects directly to the Bolt cloud and needs a Wi-Fi connection to perform any task. The code is not on the board but on the cloud. This helps with multiple devices uh, to work on the same code. This makes updating the systems very easy and one doesn't have to upload and re-upload the code on the multiple devices that may be using the same code. But we can just connect the Bolt Wi-Fi module to a product and the code will be uploaded directly. So I think this is enough on the Bolt uh, Wi-Fi module and now we'll move to the project. This particular project can be used in any way we want it and anywhere we want it. I want to implement this on my door so I'll be using door security system as a door. This is the corona lockdown period and so I'm working with whatever electronics I have. So here I'm using a switch for the breach trigger. Now let's move to the code and the code file will be in the description. Let's now run it. I'll now connect the device to the cloud by powering it on. Now the device is powered on, it is uh, getting to the Wi-Fi signal and now the green light shows that it is connected to the cloud. I am using PyCharm to run my Python code and uh, now I'll run the code. It says waiting for system to be activated. Now to activate the system, I'll need to use Google Assistant. Here I'm using IFTTT, that is if this then that protocol. And uh, now let's ask Google Assistant to turn on the security system. Activate door security system. Activating door security system. See, now here it says door security system is active and uh, there is no problem. And uh, it also shows us, uh, the it gives us a confirmation uh, by a LED signal. Now let's try to simulate a breach by pressing this button. Uh, I, the delays are big so it takes a time to read uh, it says uh, alert security system breach and now it is sending me a Twilio uh, message through Twilio and it also shows us uh, that there is a breach by an LED here we can also use a buzzer see uh, this is very quick and now I have also received a message from uh, Twilio unlocking my phone and now you can see this is the latest message this is 809 809 and I have received a message from Twilio suggesting there is an alert and uh, someone opened the door and a possible breach has been detected now let us deactivate the system here of course we need to deactivate the system to open the door now let's see if this works Deactivate door security system. Deactivating door security system. Okay, so here it says door security security system has been deactivated and uh, the LED goes off. Now we are uh, we can open the door. Security system is now deactivated, so even if I press the button, uh, there is no alert uh, sent because the system is deactivated. Now if I reactivate the system, it will again send me a message. Uh, this is the LED, uh, to, uh, this, is, uh, this one is the LED to suggest that there is a breach 
and uh, it will uh, it uh, can be also used as a buzzer so this has been my door security system project thank you very much to all for watching and uh, this is my first ever video on youtube so feel free to give me whatever feedback uh, you feel every feedback will be considered as good and please let me know what can i improve on thank you very much